Hi, I'm Freya Barnes, Deputy Visual Arts Editor at Time Out, and I'm here in bed with Inga and Mikkel of Elm Green and Drag Set at the V&A for their latest exhibition. But we're in the V&A, but we're not. And I was wondering if you can tell me where we are exactly. We're in the home of uh, an architect that lives here in mm -hmm. South Kensington. His name is Norman Swan. He's an elderly man. He had a lot of visions for his architecture, but not so many are realized. And you can come and visit him. And where did the idea for Norman Swan kind of come from? Well, we are a bit obsessed with failure, people who fail in their life. And Norman Swan is one of these kind of persons. So you can come to his grand family home that he inherited. And then you can play private detective and see all the small kind of failures in his life. And so can you tell us about the drugs in the side drawer? Is this part of the problems that Norman's had? Norman had a wild life which caused him some health problems. <laughs> and uh, today he has to take a lot of medicine. He's uh, 75 today. So if it smells a bit of old man's <laughs> pee in the bed, it's <laughs> their fault. <laughs> You used a lot of the objects in the installation are from the v &A collection. How did you go about choosing those? Well, we chose objects that help us tell the story of Norman Swan. We personalise in a way the objects that are normally on display in a very sort of um, institutional way. What I want you to do is I want you to show me your kind of your favourite items that you selected from the collection. Sure, we have to get we out of bed then. Yeah, we yeah. have to get out of bed. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> One of my favourites from uh, the v &A collection, it's an oversized fig leaf. This fig leaf was um, taken out and put onto the David Sculpture's private parts uh, every time that Queen Victoria was visiting her own museum. And that was, of course, to protect the Queen's uh, modesty. And uh, it's a beautiful object in itself, and we've been very lucky to be able to place that in Norman's Hall. Here we are in the architect's study with his kind of variety of models of his unrealised projects, and also a vulture, which is a kind of recurring motif in your work. Yeah, we call it the critic. So we promised ourselves like a, a couple of years ago that we would never do a solo presentation without having a vulture being included, because he's giving us the worst critiques ever. And then it's already done. You don't get sad if you get a bad review from someone else, no? It's very harsh. You have him on top of the bed. But there it seems to be a slightly even more sinister aspect in the bedroom. Yeah, he takes care of your bad dreams <laughs> and that you're aware that you're not going to be here. <laughs> it's just a question of time. Okay. Brilliant. Well, thank you so much for the tour. You're okay. very welcome. See you later. Come back soon. <laughs>